let's uh, study the areolar tissue now it is named so it is named areolar because it takes the form of fine threads crossing each other in every direction leaving small spaces called areoli so here you can have an overview of the areolar tissue so you can see that the threads are crossing each other in a haphazard way irregular way and spaces are bound in between spaces are bound in between open spaces these are known as areoli nothing else it contains fibroblast macrophages lymphocytes plasma cells mesenchyme cells chromatophores and mast cells so these are the several types of cells which are going to make up the areolar tissue system which is an example of our connective tissue system network in the body so areolar tissue is acting as a support framework for epithelium just like you can understand by the diagram given here so these are the various layers nothing else of areolar tissues it is widely distributed tissue present under the skin so just under the skin we are having areolar tissue which is very widely distributed apart from binding together the parts it also provides strength elasticity and help in rapid diffusion so areolar tissue has several functions not only one and for carrying out the functions specialized cells are present in the tissue and those are widely distributed just under the skin 